for sure. Are you back? You all right? Is this your house? No, you get sad. Is this your house? Gone. You're getting a wee bit upset. How? It's okay. Does it make me feel a wee bit sad? The usually chatty Cameron has become strangely subdued. Just below the house, there are rock pools, and there is a gate to the beach. There's a gate round there. They said that was a secret way. They called it the secret way under the house. He's just saying he's excited, but he's sad as well. I think he's surprised and he's not sure how he's feeling. I'm not sure how I'm feeling either, to be honest. Can we come in? <laughs> He's got a fire like that, haven't we? Let me look. I know, wow. You okay? Although much of the furniture and decor is recent, some of the features of the house, like the open fire, have remained unchanged for decades. I could see the beach when I looked out the window and sometimes my brothers and sisters could go all by themselves and I looked out my window saying, and I saw them playing. The girls were in this room? Yes. And you, the boys were in the other room? Yes. Was it the same stuff? Mm. Did you just have the fire lit? Are you glad you came here to see it? Did you think your bad mum was going to still be here? Yeah? No. Do you mess up? Oh. You've got me, haven't you? You about ready to go back home now? Yeah, get on the plane and fly home. Well, it's been quite an interesting trip. I mean, we came here with a name and a description of a house, which was not very much to go on. And we found that, in fact, there was a family here and that, in fact, they had a house in the right location and the right appearance of what we were looking for. At this point, the investigation remains inconclusive, um, but we've got some very solid leads to go on and we should be able to find out the details of this Robertson family to see if in fact they do match with what Cameron has been saying. Back in Glasgow, Norma has arranged a meeting with Ruth Borum, a genealogist who has investigated the Robertson family history for her. She has found that the Robertsons came from Glasgow and that they owned the house on Barra for more than 20 years. She has traced a Jilly Robertson who still lives in Scotland. But you don't know women, you don't know the same And I've been able to find 
a phone number and an address for Gillian and her husband. Gillie Robertson would have been a child holidaying in the house on Barra at the same time as Cameron believes that he lived there. I've, I can pass that on to you and... Just so you can, would we be allowed to contact him? Uh, her address and phone number is in the BT phone book, so, yeah. so it, it's public knowledge, so that would certainly be, be a possibility. And she was... <laughs> She fits with the right sort of age. Yes, she had two son, uh, two brothers, and a daughter. Wow. <laughs> Norma now has a name and telephone number for a living member of the Robertson family. The search for answers is nearing its conclusion.